Samantha here and welcome back to another early access look at the newest Sims 4 stuff pack nifty knitting and just want to remind you guys that I did receive early access of this stuff pack compliments of EA Game Changers so thanks to EA Game Changers for that so even though the stuff pack was not really jam-packed full of stuff like I really was hoping I kind of still wanted to do like a cute little build with it I don't know I was kind of inspired by um, the crafty room type things and instead of having like an actual craft room room like office inside of a house I decided I'd make like a she shed I know I got this idea from it was like a farmer's commercial I think one of those little insurance commercials and this lady's she shed was set on fire and I'm not saying that this is very similar to that she shed from that commercial but it's supposed to be like a little not like an outhouse but like a utility house like room I don't know that you can have all your stuff in for your crafting needs and I always envisioned because I wanted one myself at one point that it'd be a place that was separate from the house like your little personal getaway you can go and relax unwind listen to music just be in your element and then when you're done you just leave so that way if there's like junk on the floor if there's paper if there's stuff still scattered from projects that you were still working on then you could just legitimately leave it and call it a day and not feel guilty about having like a clean space and then of course I would always picture for your mental well-being especially well i'm going to speak personally like as a personal experience for me uh being hands-on crafty uh being crafty um even when it comes to like making videos and stuff uh for youtube or streaming on twitch it is like a mental getaway for me and so just to have like your own little space where you can kind of unwind um you know all your stresses from the day you could just kind of like leave it on there whatever it just it always was kind of uh i guess not important to me per se but i always felt it was special to have like my own little area to kind of unwind and just decompress for lack of a better word so she shed is pretty much what <laughs> we got here now i will say the main lot or the main part of this lot which is the house is a lot that i got off the gallery if you guys want the information about it please let me know down in the comment box because honestly i liked how it looked on the outside i didn't even look at the inside until i actually went in to do the gameplay which you guys will see at the end of this video so this is kind of like a combination of a speed build just kind like showing you some of the stuff you can do with the pack um and also uh gameplay which spoiler alert i was pleasantly surprised at the gameplay which still baffles me that this considered a stuff pack when i feel like it really should have been considered a game pack but maybe they explained it i know i'm like a broken record at this point maybe they explained it in one of the live streams that i missed or maybe they explained it on twitter as to why they're calling it a stuff pack and not a game pack i don't know but it is unless it's a typo on my end everything i read said stuff pack and i had to keep going back to double check are you sure it's a stuff pack anyway um <laughs> i do like a lot of the decor items i'm not gonna lie and tell you guys that i feel like oh wow it was just so much stuff it wasn't a lot of stuff in the cast and um the gameplay like i'm sorry the cast and the build by mode stuff uh sadly it wasn't a lot of stuff if i'm just being honest with you guys so um i was a little bit disappointed by that but i will say once you actually get into nifting nifting wow <laughs> knitting and actually doing the crafting aspect there's quite a bit of stuff that you can make from it um it does take a lot of time and skill on your sims part in order to unlock all of the stuff at least the stuff that i felt like that would be usable like some of the clothing items and some of the decor and object items um but for the most part i i think it it, it was a pretty uh pretty it's, it's a pretty it's a pretty interesting pack um would i recommend you get it just out the gate um that's that's tough i feel like if you feel like there's a need for it then go for it but if you don't feel like there's a need for it i i honestly can say that i don't feel like it's absolutely necessary for you to run out and go grab it if that makes any sense hopefully that makes sense um i mean it's got some good stuff in it but it's not oh gosh how can i put this it's not going to be like the thing that's just going to make your sims experience that much greater in my opinion of course um but you guys can you know look at the stuff that i've uh, discovered in this little um 
I guess experience with it the last couple hours and you just you know figure it out on your own let me know what you guys think down in the comment box as well so um the only the only kind of confusing or not even confusing thing i guess i will say like with the bill buy stuff especially like with the craft room stuff you could mix it in with your woodworking tool shit set your flower um deck what is it called the flower caddy thingy where you make your own flower arrangements and the painting you know you could mix it in with that stuff and have like a whole you know craft area type thing and you can have a sim that's just totally hands-on and that just sells their handmade goods like everywhere like all the time you could totally do that and uh it'll it'll kind of help with the gameplay i guess in that aspect if you think about it as a whole but um on its own i don't know i'm, I'm on the fence about it i'm not going to lie to you guys but um anyway i liked how the shed came out i think it's really cute if you guys want me to put it in the gallery i could put it in as a room so you could just add it to the back of you know one of your sims houses if you'd like to or um I don't know just it just depends on what you want to do with that uh but i can add it to the gallery if you guys would want me to so i'm going to go on and let this little quickie speed build y'all i think it took me like 20 30 minutes it didn't even take me that long i'm gonna let it finish up and i'll see you guys on the other side for some gameplay I was playing around with the knitting skill and apparently let's just double check really quickly because I wanted to kind of go over this with you guys. She is at a level two right now. And when I click the couch to see if you can knit from the couch, it actually comes up knit clothing. And then I checked the um, the rocking chair and it does also have knit clothing. So we can either do beanies, beanies or socks or we could resume the knitting project, which is what we were doing earlier, uh, which was the socks. So let's go on and complete this, the gray dotted black socks and uh, what i'm gathering just based <laughs> on what i saw from the um oh, pre no, she is it? so bored she's not enjoying Bless it i guess name. because Bless i made her a snob name. she's just not enjoying <laughs> um <laughs> And then, oh, what's her name? Francine Spencer came Damn, over here. I'm like, what is she doing way over here? She's supposed to be in Evergreen Harbor, but she came way over here just to chat with us, and we don't even know who she is. But anyway, I did see that we were able to also give these as gifts. We could actually um, gift to Francine, which I want to do that in a second. Uh, but if you add it to wardrobe, that is how it becomes unlocked in your cast. So it's quite a bit of things that you have to make in order to... Um, because think about it, it's the beanies, right? Let me show you guys one more time. So it's the beanies and it's one, two, three, four, five, six. What's that? Seven, eight, roughly eight or nine. I can't remember. Uh, beanies that you can make um, and the different variations of it. So um, it's kind of cute. Um, the only thing I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit perplexed about is that so far, even though she just started, everything oh, is like normal quality i don't know if they'll be like more excellent oh, yeah. or whether they'll be poor quality oh, or what have you her traits <laughs> though are ambitious uh, unflirty and oh. snob so i don't know if maybe her traits end up helping her out oh, so francine i was going to give you this darling like you leave it and i was going to give it to you uh let me see if i can gift it to her though before she goes but uh that's the only thing that i really don't see like a variation of the quality uh -huh. so i kind of wish i know this is me being kind of critical again but i kind of wish that there could be a poor quality and maybe there's like strings or fringe coming from it or maybe like one of the eyes is crooked or something because this is her first time knitting you can't tell me a skill level one and we just out the gate you know what i'm saying like did the perfect knit beanie she is so bored though y'all like none of this like thrills her at all um Anyway, I did get this house from the gallery, so if you guys are interested in it. Oh, I didn't even come in here to see what it looked like. Uh, but anyway, so we're giving her the gift of the beanie. Let's see if she actually does anything with it. Okay, does she like it? Okay, that'd be really cute if she was to put it on like right then and there. Okay, so even though I gave it to her, it's... Oh, there it is. I'm gonna say it's still in her inventory. So, knit clothing. We still can just knit socks. Uh, we've already knit this one so i guess let's try it. wow there's like a lot of socks you can knit oh wow okay so these are all level two so we could do cream mid calf socks blue yellow teal gray let's do the purple stripe mid calf socks and go try those out now i'm assuming since we didn't add that to the wardrobe it will not be unlocked in cast for us because we gave it to francine um so we'll have to check it out and see that later um is that a hedgehog 
Okay, I like totally just got sidetracked. Anyway, so hopefully, okay, so we're knitting now. And it seems like she prefers the rocking chair over the couch. Because like every time I just toggle her to knit, she goes to the couch. Um, the only thing that's kind of weird is like you can't do it from here because it has to be in their inventory. So that's, I wish that there was a way. Because I feel like this is like a decor item too. So the fact that we have to just have it in the inventory in order to, to knit stuff. It's kind of interesting. Oh, oh, here we go. Pour. So we did get a quality of pour on something. All right, let's add that to uh, to the wardrobe and see what that looks like here in a second. So that has been added to the wardrobe. Mismatched socks are now available for all household members in Create a Sim. Select plan outfit and a dresser or mirror to change into the new mismatched socks. So I don't know if that was one that I actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, I ended up doing gray dotted crew. So you know what? I did the top one and because they were poor quality, they ended up being bad. So there is a way for you to get poor quality stuff. All right, cool. Um, so now that we're at skill level three, it looks like we're able to knit objects. So we could do a knit hanging plant holder or mailbox cozy, cozy, cozy. Let's do one of those. Uh, I'll just do like this. It's pink and white. Yeah, let's do it because it'll go in her craft room really good. Or I mean her she shed. And then we'll go on and do a cozy too. And we'll just do the pink mailbox one. See how that looks. I'm going to fast forward a little bit so we can go on and do that. So the animation and the yarn is the same no matter what. Um, it seems like there, I mean, I guess there was a variation where I saw purple earlier. I don't know if she's going to get, okay. So that was the socks. So purple strikes and those actually are end up being mm -hmm. decent. So let's go on and add those to the wardrobe too. And she's doing the next project, knitting project complete. Look in mm -hmm. Hel Helena's swans inventory to see her new creation. All right. So we'll have to check all those out and see what that looks like. Uh, she has to use the restroom. So toggle her up to do that here in a second before she has an accident all right um and then we'll do the next thing so let's see what that looks like so we have this now it's a short hanger for succulent in a round what does it say in a round pot uh and just for the sake of just doing it i think i'll put it uh oh where'd it go oh gosh i lost it oh oh that's what it looks like it's actually a hanging pot wait can i move it okay let me get in build by mode so we can go check it out. This is actually really cute. I don't know why I thought it was gonna be like hanging from like the wall, but it actually hangs from the ceiling. Um, I have like extra lights in here, so it's not really giving me the ability to pull. Here we go, put it over here in the corner. Oh, y'all, that is really cool. I actually kind of really like that. Oh, that is really pretty. Okay, that is really cool. It goes really nicely in her room too. All right, she needs to eat something. So I'm gonna have her just really quickly go get a snack and then we'll finish up the last little project that we need to do. If you could just really quickly have a quick meal, darling. Some animal crackers will do just fine. And we probably need to feed the cat because since we've been in this lot, I have not <laughs> fed the cat. Uh, surprisingly, oh, here we go. I'm gonna say surprisingly, this is a house with a, a, a cat, but you see this house, this thing right here, but. This is a really cute lot. If you guys want the information on this lot, let me know. Because I didn't even come in here and look. I really just grabbed a lot. <laughs> just to create this. <laughs> Her little she shed. The little matching she shed. But this looks like this character. And that's crazy. Because I literally just picked it out of nowhere. Oh, there's like cat stuff all over the place. Uh oh. Do we need to call her down to come eat? Probably. Call Shelby to eat. All right. And then we'll come back in here. And finish knitting um, whatever we were doing. The mailbox cozy. Because I kind of want to see what that looks like. Do you actually put it? Oh, do we? Oh, we do have mailbox. Okay. Do you actually put it on the mailbox? We'll have to check it out and see. Or will it just be like an actual mailbox itself? Did she come down? Shelby. It's time to eat dwellings. All right. Just stop. Just stop that. Because it's taking you way too long to eat these animal crackers. Like, it's not It's not that serious. Call Shelby. Call ah, her. There you go. Come on, Shelby. Come eat, darling. All right, and then we'll come back in here in her she shed and finish <laughs> in her she shed. <laughs> I'm reminded of the commercial. Is it Farmers? Where it was like somebody set fire to the lady she shed. Wait, milestone complete that quick? All right, so achieve level 4 to so knit while listening to music, which is, I need to put this on. Let's play um, Easy Listening. And then sell, sell a knitted object on Plopsy. Okay, we have to check that out soon. All right, so hopefully this cozy will come out good 
And then we can kind of see what that looks like. Uh, is the cow? Oh, <gasps> wait a minute. Wait a minute. So the cat, wait y'all, I got way too excited right there. I'm sorry. The cats do actually play with the yarn. Oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on. We gotta see this in action a lot, y'all. We have to see this in action. Oh my good, oh my gosh, that is adorable. Cause I was trying to get her to play with it earlier. So she literally just took it off the shelf on her own and was like, I got this. She's like batting it back and forth, y'all. That is a, oh, uh-oh, wait. Okay, Shelby, did you, did you, what happened to it? Oh, it just popped back up there. Okay, okay, I might say she put it back over there. <laughs> I thought it went underneath the thing. I said, uh oh, she lost it. Never mind. She didn't lose it. Um, so the only weird thing is, is like it has all this stuff up here for like a craft. I guess you can make like a huge just craft room with like painting and stuff, maybe like a floral. Okay, so we got this taken care of. So, all right, let's do one thing really quickly before we lose. Is this some? Oh, oh, oh my goodness, that is adorable. Wow. You know, it's kind of interesting. This is really cute, but I'm I'm curious as to how. <laughs> she did not craft any woodworking stuff. It was just all yarn and it ended up being this cute thing right here. Um, let's drag it to the front. It's actually worth $34 if I was to sell it, but I'm actually gonna use it as our mailbox here. Uh, let's turn it this way. Uh, there we go. And we'll probably get rid of that one when I get into build by mode. Um, all right, cool. So let's really quickly go into cast and then we'll have her work on one more thing so we could uh, sell it on Plopsy because I kind of want to see what that looks like. So let's go check out the socks. So like I said, one of the socks I did um, right before oh, I started uh, recording the gameplay was the gray socks, which apparently came out as mix match socks. So let's go take a look at them real quick. I think I'm gonna go on and toggle it for um, nifty knitting. There we go. So are these the ones? We've just unlocked these, the mix match socks, okay. Uh, let me take our shoes off really quickly so we can check them out. I'm not gonna be able to zoom in on them very well, but you guys kind of get the picture. So now I guess my question is, requires knitting level two. Okay, so we can't even like see what these look like. So these were the poor quality socks. And honestly, besides them being mix matched, I don't know if that's what they would look like if they were perfect quality. And then we have the long socks, which these are really cute. Um, I'm almost tempted to say, could you put them with, yeah, with like boots? Ooh, you could do like a layered look with them. Put it with your cowboy boots. Um, these are too high, uh, but you guys get the picture. I actually like boots with uh, knit socks that kind of like peek at the top of them. I don't know why I like that, but if we put it with the boots that we actually got with the pack, let's see what that might look like. I'm trying to find some more that's low enough where you could see like the top of them, like these. That's actually a really cute. Oh y'all, that's actually. Wait, when did we get? When did we get these boots? Are they? Okay, I don't even remember when we got those boots. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes I'm in cast, y'all, and I'm like, how? When did we get that stuff? So it doesn't work really good with those, but you guys kind of get the picture. So you can have different ways to layer the looks and whatnot. So the only thing is we haven't, and I don't even know. Let's see real quick. Not locked. Uh, nifty knitting. <laughs> so we got this real hook. We need a level five for that. All right. Um, so let me get out of here. We're not going to use that yet. Just cancel it. We're not going to use that outfit per se. I just kind of wanted to see what they looked like. So I want to go back in. We did. Let's see what else we can do really quickly for, um, I know she has to probably go to sleep. So knit objects. We can do a rug. Ooh. Okay. So we could do a purple and blue, teal and green, yellow, dark green, black, or white rug. So let's go on and do, I guess, a white rug. Maybe we can put it, actually, don't do that. Knit objects rugs so let's see if we can make one that goes in her craft room here let's do that one all right and see how that works out for us um again the knitting the knitting interaction is pretty much the same they don't make mistakes it's not like she pokes herself or the colors change depending upon what you do it's pretty much the same animation over and over again i think the only difference is if she was to get in the rocking chair she'll kind of like rock back and forth um as far as clothing goes we still have beanies and socks we've only unlocked Wow, we've only unlocked this one because we gave the black and white one 
to um, our friend that came over. I forget her name just that quick. Uh, Francine, we gave it to Francine. So I guess that means we didn't unlock it. And our knitting level is already a level four, which was kind of quick considering that I've only been playing with her for like a couple minutes at this point. And then the same thing with the socks. We haven't unlocked anything but the purple because we ended up getting a poor quality on the gray. Wait, what are these? Low cut socks. Yeah, we got a lot of socks we can do. All right, I will try to do the gray dotted crew ones one more time. And then I'll probably let her get some sleep because she's going to be super tired. But I kind of want to see how far we can go before. Um... Let me see these again. Y'all, this is a lot of stuff. <gasps> oh, OK. So not only do you get the um, the succulus ones, look like you get ones that are like three, look like three pots. So you get the one that's one pot, the one that's three pot. And then you get the ones that's got like like this larger planter sling plant that hangs just off the ceiling and these are all level three um we might do another one of these just so i could see what they look like and then maybe sell one on plopsy uh then we got the long cream okay these are for maybe taller sims cannot walk underneath it this hanger is long okay so they get longer all right let's try to do a three one one that's a three one i know i'm probably doing way too much but i guess my question is going to be is if we end up selling it on plopsy well these don't need to be unlocked donate short list on plopsy hmm. okay we're gonna try it we're gonna try it for sure so i'm gonna fast forward a little bit i might hmm. cheat her just as a matter of fact i am going to cheat her y'all because it doesn't make any sense uh chini let's make her happy all right she's good to go um, she's feeling great from high needs and she has neat mm -hmm. knits knitting project complete mm -hmm. combination of patience passion and perseverance oh we lost it all right mm -hmm. you guys get the picture though are we listening to music right now is music mm -hmm. on i don't even know play mm -hmm. easy listening i don't even know if we are listening to music right now i don't have my headphones on for once so <laughs> i don't even know if we have it knit while listening to music mm -hmm. all right oh do we have oh. to physically like listen to it Mm -hmm. knitting project complete all right so is it in our inventory so it should be in our inventory there it is right there all right let's go see what oh was she playing with this again and i missed it let's go see what that looks like Ooh, hold on y'all she's gonna probably pop up and it's gonna make me upset but it is what it is i'm actually gonna put this in our inventory and then do the same thing to this real quick all right cool and then we can see this rug. I actually really like the rug. What's crazy is look at the details. It literally looks like it's been uh -huh. knitted. Mm -hmm. Okay, I really like the details. And it just really made her room pop. Because I was trying to do like a very colorful with like pink to match like the exterior. But keep like these teals kind of like um, going through it. That's really cute. Oh my goodness, that is adorable. <laughs> she was sleeping her feet. All right, so we're at level five of the knitting skill. All right, so let's see what we got. Okay, so we're listening to music. Perfect. We got music on right now. And this is the medium ha hanger for three plants, and it's excellent quality. So let's try to list that on Plopsy, and then we'll actually go on and add that to our wardrobe. Uh huh. And let's see what that looks like. So, how do you list all? Okay, so we get online to list it on Plopsy. All right, are we on Plopsy right now? Oh, okay, that was quick. All right, knitting project. Okay, du -du -du -du. Oh, okay. Where's the notification know. for the Plopsy knitting project completed? So is it on Plopsy right now? Oh, selling price no offers yet. Expiration time Friday. Buyer no buyers yet. All right. So can we do anything with it unless from Plopsy? All right. So we could just keep those in Plopsy. All right. So let's go on and try to knit some more clothing. Now we could do sweaters. All right. Let's see. We got the beige and red women's sweater with dress. Oh. Let's do the pink since we've been digging pink lately, but let's see what other options we got. Then we got the black men's sweater. Um, then we got the cream, the children's sweater. All right, there we go. All right, so let's try to do, I wanna see what this one looks like with the dress. So we'll do this real quick and hopefully she'll listen to music while we do this. Now this expires on Friday, it says. So I guess if we don't sell it by Friday, it'll just come back into our inventory. Um, so I have to see what that looks like. Hopefully we'll get a good, it's excellent quality. So I don't see why we wouldn't. So I'm going to fast forward a little bit. Are we getting credit for listening to music while knitting? I don't know. Cause this is a speaker, but it's more like a, an Alexa. Well, Lindsay, <laughs> don't they call it Alexa? I don't even know. All right. So we're knitting our dress right now. Is the cat, did she get another ball? Okay. I thought she got another ball. That is so cute y'all. I almost would rather like 
if we're gonna knit. I heard there's someone famous over the lounge. Wanna check it out? No. Francine is like her only friend in this game file, I swear. All right, let's close this out and see what we got going on next. Let me fast forward a little bit more. We're almost there. I kind of want to see what this looks like in the inventory, but I am shocked that her level is going up so fast. Uh, it's only been like, what, a roughly like 15 minutes, I think. Um, and she's already at a level five and on her way uh -huh. to six. Like what in the world? All right, let's check it out real quick. It is considered excellent quality as well. So let's go on and add to wardrobe and then let's go on and get in cast and go see what it looks like. I don't even remember seeing this on the full body, to be honest on with you guys. So this is about to be a shocker. All right, let's go in here. I'm going to go on and toggle it for nitty nifting, nifty knitting. And there is the dress. And oh, that is actually really. Oh, I keep wanting to go down to the swatches. And I'm like, I want to see what the other ones look like. And there aren't any other ones. Um, I actually really like this. I like the layered look. The funny thing is I feel like she could have totally made the sweater, but the dress underneath it, the button details and stuff like that is actually really cute. Um, let me take this crazy hat off her head because <laughs> she don't have to have that hat on with everything. We'll keep this dress on for a little bit because I kind of want to see. Uh, and did we put the other socks in here or no? I can't remember. Let's see real quick if we put the other socks in here because I know we did the gray one so i kind of want to see what they look like okay so we got these right here okay which are literally great and then we also unlocked oh so look at the difference so these are the decent quality ones these are the poor so the poor ended up coming out mixed match these came out just regular which is what we wanted all right cool so we still have these lower um i guess ankle socks that we haven't crafted and then of course all the swatches. So eventually you're gonna wanna craft all the swatches in order to unlock all of them in cast. Now, the question is, once you unlock them all in cast, is it unlocked across all of your save files or just for that particular household? It seems like when you see what it says, like when you oh, click gotcha. it, it says for the household. So, all right, let's see if we unlocked anything else. We got sweaters. All right, let's unlock, let's do another sweater real quick. Let's do, we don't have any men in the household. We don't have any kids either. So maybe we won't do that. All right, so let's go and do uh, knit objects. So we oh. still got the hang hangers and stuff like that. All right, I guess let's try to try to do one of the, not a long one, because we're not going to be able to walk underneath there. So let's do a short uh, brown, brown, teal. Let's try that one. Okay, we'll do that one for a little bit. See if we can get her skill level up to six, and then we can see what happens after that. As far as beanies go, it's just those. So we probably need to do some more so we can unlock some mm -hmm. more. And then I think that's it. Clothing and then socks is just... Yeah, it's just all the socks that we haven't done yet. Ooh, these gradient ones might be cute to look at. So we'll do those too. So let's fast forward a little bit. I kind of want to see what this is going to look like. We don't have any buyers or no offers yet. Um, I'm not even sure what we selling it for. Like it didn't say like what the listing price was. So we'll have to wait and see how long it takes. I kind of want to wait till Friday and see if it's going to sell. It's excellent quality though. I can't see what, who in the world is the best? Hey, hey champ. So get this. Oh girl, I can't afford that right now. Oh, but how else are my dreams supposed to come true? I get out and work like everybody else. Thanks anyway, I guess. Girl, you'll get you'll get over it. I promise you. That's my first time ever seeing her cold call somebody, especially when we're in Newcrest right now, y'all. I kid y'all not. We're in Newcrest. Like, why is you calling me way over here, girl? <laughs> why is you calling me way over here? Anyway, all right. So we got the hanging planter here. Let's put it up somewhere. I kind of want to see what it looks like. Um, where'd it go? I want to do the same thing over here. Oh, dang it. I can't put it. Okay, I guess we'll just put it there. Oh, y'all, that is absolutely stunning. Oh, hold on. I got to see it. I got to see it. I got to put it in. I want to put it in the corner like how we just did. Is it because it's too big? It must be because it's too big. All right. Um, uh, where can I put it at? Uh, All right. I guess we'll just stick it right here. Wait, I just had it. Right there. All right, cool. All right. That is actually really cute. That is really cute. It's it's funny though because in my head I'm just like it doesn't make any sense for her to have knitted this because there's like beads involved, there's ceramics, there's dirt and there's a, a plant. But somehow we like logically just my brain can't 
my brain can't wrap around it. Like logically, this makes absolutely no sense. All right, let's see where we're at for skill now. We're still at five. I'll kind of want to get to six to see if we unlock anything hmm. else. And part of me also just wants to cheat her all the way to 10, but I don't have any, um, I don't even know the cheat code in order to cheat her all the way to 10. But you guys kind of get the picture, I think, uh, when it comes to this. It's kind of, kind of self-explanatory. All right, let's see what we got now. So we got these right quick. Let's add these to the wardrobe and then let's go check those out in cast. Uh, modifying cast. That's crazy. Is that remove her from family? Where is she going if I'm removing her from family? Boom, in a I'm just curious. All right, the pink and purple. Let's check them out real quick. I'm excited to see these because I can just imagine they're going to be super cute. Um, I wonder if, uh, let's see. So are they going to be here? All right. So we got, oh, oh, those are so cute. Oh, I like those. The only thing that'll make it a little bit different, I guess, for me, which would make me be like, oh, this is really cool, is if we, like, if it's a certain color and we'd have to buy yarn for that color. Like, if those are pink and purple, then we should have pink and purple yarn on hand. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like if they could have just snatched, snatched it up just a little bit more when it came to that so that we could really see, like, um... <laughs> See, like the whole pro. Wow, the cat keeps messing with the yarn. I'm not even paying attention. All right, let me go grab her some. Oh no, this spoiled. Okay, clean up. Let me talk to this uh, feed it a treat. Let me let me talk to this uh, play with her. Talk to her, him or her. I don't know what it is. Um, talk to. Him. All right, and then I think I'm gonna go back in here and try to do some more stuff. Look at the cat, y'all. I love this cat. I swear. Do not be surprised if y'all see this cat in another LP. <laughs> I will upload this cat all by herself in the um in the oh what are you doing oh you went and got another one is that your favorite color oh my gosh y'all this is stinking adorable i wonder if the animation is the same if it was a if it was a um a toy oh are you kidding me do it again so i could get a picture that is adorable do it again so i can get a picture dang it get another one Shelby, get another one. Shelby, Shelby, darling, get, you got three up there. You got this pink one behind you too. Shelby, she's totally ignoring me. <laughs> she's totally ignoring me. She's just like, why come? Why come? Why? Why do you want me to do this? I, I've had enough fun for the day. Aw, get another one so I can see you do it again. I want to see her roll over on her on her back and play. Okay, all right. I tried. All right. Um, so she needs to use the restroom and stuff like that. But I think for the most part, I kind of get the uh, picture. So there is going to be some bill buy items that you can make from this. And then of course the rugs. Um, I'm curious though. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to pause the recording for a little bit, try to get her skill level up as much as one possible. One and Barbara then, Hoy, um, Shusha. see what Lost else we can do. Cause I mean, clothes, it seems like we've done right. all of the socks the sweaters and things of that nature but the bill buy items i'm feeling like there's going to be some stuff that's going to unlock that the only way we'll be able to see it is if she crafts it so i will see you guys in a little bit okay guys just a little status update on our knitter here is we are currently on six almost to seven and i had her crafting quite a bit of stuff some things um actually <laughs> a lot of things uh these are actually good but these were considered poor quality and i kind of want to see what they look like but unfortunately um they're for a kids and we don't have a kid in the household so we can either donate it or um frog it which unravels it and we'll get a little bit of the money back but surprisingly this cable knit rug is considered poor quality but i'm looking at it like oh never mind <laughs> in the in the picture like in the little thumbnail i was thinking i like the colors but then when we got off into looking at it in the actual game it totally that's funny because didn't i say that earlier i was like i kind of wish that there would be different qualities of stuff like poor or whatever whatever so there are different qualities depending upon i can't even say it's dependent upon our skill i think it's just a matter of chance because we're like a six right and she was able to create this rug with all these spots and holes in it at this point, it doesn't even look like a rug that um, was just poorly made. It looks like a rug that's old, in my opinion. You know, like like it just it just has gotten torn. Maybe the cat has walked on it too much with her claws. I do see one mistake here, like with the yellow tassel as opposed to purple. And over here, they're pink. But yeah, that's quite interesting. Um, we spent $60 for it, but it's 
worth 53 if we were to sell it uh but and then this sweater here i really want to see what this looks like but i don't i don't know how to put it we'd have to find a kid but it looks like it's got a lot of holes and stuff in it too but now that we're at six on our way to seven we did do a new object it's called a poof a knit poof uh, which looks like, you know, just like a little thing you could sit on. So I'm going to have her work on these really quick. I'll make one for our room here. And then I think as far as clothing goes, we have the same exact one. So I'm going to have her work on that. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, really quickly, we got another status update. It seems like um, someone would like to purchase the medium hanger for three plants, selling it for 86 simoleons. So it says, oh boy, Sims for Life would like to purchase medium hanger for three pots on Plopsy. If you agree to sell, then find the medium hanger. Wait, if you agree to sell, then find the medium three blah, 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 in inventory and ship it to send it off to his new forever home. So we can agree to sell it for 86 simoleons, which is crazy because I think, yeah, it's only worth 38 simoleons if I was to sell it. So let's just go on and ship it on Plopsy and then we can go on and have that taken care of. So it ended up selling for a decent amount. I don't know if I didn't sell it. Like if I said, okay, I want to get a better offer. I don't know if that would have worked, but 86 simoleons. And I think in order to create it, let's see real quick, knit objects. Um, oh, we got, wait, knit decoration. Okay, we got a new thingy. Um, to do the three hangers, it only cost us $20. And it's worth 38 right now. But if we sell it to this person, we make 86 simoleons. So that's actually a decent profit. So we're going to take care of that. And then I'm also, look like we got a new object we can do is knit decorations we got a blue oh look at these octopuses oh and a turtle oh my gosh okay a penguin with a hat okay so let's oh a knit cactus y'all these are so cute a blue ceramic llama with a knit cactus these are adorable okay so let's try to make i'm digging the little octopus so let me make the octopus uh we did make the poof but it was considered poor quality uh, which is crazy, right? Because I'm looking at it like it's not... Oh, wait, I spoke too so. Oh, wait, no. There's a couple... Is that a run? Is it like a run right there? The colors are a little bit off. Uh, the colors... Oh, wait, where'd it go? Yeah, the colors are a little bit mix-matched. Um, there's a couple little pulled threads, things of that nature. But um, I'm actually... I, I prefer, if she was to get a poor quality, I prefer it be with the first time she made something as opposed to it being like perfect like the like the tiger hat she made earlier um and then we also are making some more beanies and stuff so i think right now she's at a seven and we've unlocked more things to um no more clothes but definitely new objects so we got the decorations these are so cute y'all i think i'm gonna do a couple of them just so we can get her level up and let's see knit decorations um let's do a turtle Oh, and keeps full. All right, so I'm going to fast forward here and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, so it's been a couple of minutes, I guess, or hours mm -hmm. in the game, I guess you could say, and we've got mm -hmm. quite a bit of stuff we crafted. So just a heads up, once I was able to mail that item onto Plopsy, it said that I only got 56 simoleons into our bank account. So there was a fee associated with listing it on Plopsy and I guess maybe shipping or maybe seller's fees or whatever. So we actually lost, so it wasn't 86 that actually got deposited into the account. It was more like 56, which is still not too bad considering that the item was only worth 38 simoleons. So if you did a bunch of things on Plopsy, I'm sure you would probably do a lot better. So we do have one <laughs> poor beanie that was created and it's called, don't worry, we still love you bear beanie. Uh, and then of course we got another poof. We did one that was uh poor and we ended up doing another one but this is the one that eventually ended up working out good for us so it took her quite a few tries in order for us to get the perfect poof and you guys can kind of see it right here it goes really good um with the furniture and surprisingly also with the rug if you guys could kind of like get a good idea about it so i really do like it i think it's considered a chair right so yeah, you could sit on there, but you might could even put some stuff on there if you wanted to. Um, all right, so we got the toys right here. You're gonna hear my kids in the background. I apologize about that. But anyway, uh, we got the turtle here, which it looks like donate Timmy the turtle to charity. Uh, we can't name it or anything like that, but it kind of looks like a toy. Oh my gosh, y'all that. Wait, is this good quality? I can't remember. Hold on, let's see if it's, okay, excellent. And then this one is, okay, so normal. All right, so let's put these out real quick. I don't know if the, um, 
if the cat will mess with them. But all these, I think, is this a good quality too? Okay, yeah, all these are good quality, so you guys can kind of see. I got her crafting a couple more, so we can kind of see what these look like. But I wonder if these would be considered toys, or because they're considering them. Well, they're saying decor, but I'm wondering if they're considered as toys. But that is stinking adorable. Look at that, and the little eyes on the octopus and the other little turtle. Oh my gosh, that is so cute, y'all. Um, I also want to say, too, even if you get this and you don't actually do anything with it, the cat takes um, the yarn balls out of there, too, and, and she'll mess with them and stuff. So something to think about if you guys are interested uh, in having this that out for your cats, even if you don't use it for anything else. All right, and here is the little penguin. You could use that for, like, Christmas decor. I actually want to go in and add these to the wardrobe so we can kind of see... Add to wardrobe, add to wardrobe, and add to wardrobe. We can kind of see what that stuff looks like. Oh, and then we need to put these two. Add to wardrobe. All right. Uh, now she's working on, I'm not sure what she's working on right now, but let's see. Her level is at a level eight, so we're pretty much almost maxed out. All right, so now we got some more clothes. We could do baby onesies and toddler onesies. So we got the cream toddler onesie with a pink elephant. Um, it comes in different colors. And of course, we got a froggy one. And that comes in different colors. And then we have a cat one. Y'all, these are adorable. Look at the calico cat one. I don't even have a toddler in this household. <gasps> that just hurts my heart. All right, knit baby onesies. Let's go on and do that. And if I'm not mistaken, you could actually put these on the babies. I do remember that from all of the Twitter rants that people were, oh my gosh, we could put them on the babies. So that'll be really cute. So we'll probably work on that. I'll probably just sell that since we don't have a baby in the household. But if you do have um, a Sim that's pregnant and she wants to knit the baby some clothes, might be a cute idea to do that. Uh, so we did unlock all of those. It's still the same for the beanies and the socks and all that type of stuff. All right, let's see if we got anything else for objects. Look like we got the same stuff for objects. Um, the decorations, oh, we didn't do these. We, let's get one of these real quick so we can see what that looks like. Uh, let's see, knit objects. Did I get everything on there? Decorations. Okay, and then we did the llama. Okay, I need to do the llama. All right, so let's do a black one. All right, so I'm going to fast forward here. We should be at level 10 fairly soon, surprisingly. And, um, you know, so far I stand corrected. I was a little bit annoyed by the cast and the bill buy mode items. Um, for this pack but it seems like everything is in the actual hobby of the craft if that makes any sense of the actual crafting like everything is getting unlocked uh with the crafting and it's making it like we're getting way more stuff oh, legendary we got something that's considered legendary wow okay let's see how much it's worth legendary how much i want to draw okay i guess i can't do it because we're fast forward all right let's try it now I can't try. Okay, I guess I can't sell this. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're going to go on and add it to wardrobe so we can kind of see what that looks like. But they called that thing legendary. Okay, you'll be fine, Shelby. It's not even, yeah, you'll be fine. You you can go on and get out of here with, oh, oh my goodness, until you did that. You little cute thing, you. Oh my gosh. Get out of here. Thank you. <laughs> like, get out of here. Just quit it. Just quit it. Just quit it. Shelby, what are you doing? See how she pulled this out? She pulled it out, but she didn't do nothing with it. Shelby, you're, you'll be fine, Shelby. Shelby, you'll be fine. You go, go. I have to pet her for a little bit and play with it, y'all. I have been ignoring her the whole time we've been doing this. All right, knitting project complete. So we got the onesie. I just want to see what it looks like. I kind of want to like hang it up on the wall or something. It won't let me. Um, it's all good. I kind of wanted to see if she was going to play around with this stuff, but she didn't. Oh, we could put this up here? Oh my goodness gracious. Can I put you up there too? I can. So you can put their little craft thingies up here, y'all. Oh, or if you have that thing that's the shelf, the little house looking shelf, you might even put it inside that house looking uh -huh. shelf. Hold on, I'm gonna remind you guys what that is real quick before I forget. Um, let's see real quick. You might could do that. That might actually be really cute if you did something like that. Let's just do show all and this thing right here. This is what I'm talking about. Ooh, 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 ooh. If you did something like that, and then you could put this in there. Oh, it's too small, but you guys get the picture. Like, that'd be so... Oh, can you put him in there? No. All right, he's too big. Can you put him? No, he's too big as well. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Get this out of here. Thank you very much. All right. <laughs> I just wanted to see what you if you could put that. That'd be kind of cute, though. 
you can put that on shelves and stuff but i want to know we don't have a toddler but i kind of want to know if this is something that they could play with or would it just be decoration like just strictly decoration anyway all right let's see where we at right now with skill level we're at level eight so i'm gonna try to get to 10 and i'll see you guys when she gets there all right guys we have been knitting until our fingers are completely sore i'm sure she is almost at level 10 and we unlocked a couple new things and as you guys can see I have had her knitting like a doggone crazy. So let's check out some of the things that she just uh, finished up. We did the Cactus Llama, the perfect pair. Uh, ooh, okay. Can I, oh, wait, okay, I guess I can't put it there. Whoa, 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 okay, oh, I can't, oh, ooh, that's weird. I can't <laughs> put it, there you go, okay. I, like, I can't put it out for whatever reason, but it's like a mix of ceramic and knitted items, I guess you could say. And I ended up doing two of those just so I can kind of see what they looked like. And then we also did the Crafty Cactus. This one is considered legendary so we're doing pretty good i guess with her skill level and everything like that that's really cute we did a couple more octopuses and of course our octopi octopi another color i guess you could say and i'm going to actually add all of the knit beanies to her wardrobe uh we already have this one okay clearly i did too many all right and then we also did the pink woman's sweater with the purple scarf so let's add that to wardrobe we did a men's version and we did another gray one and then we did a men's version as well we did a couple more onesies and stuff for babies and i just got her working on these until we get to the max level but i can show you guys what the um the options are now so of course we got the onesie the toddler the baby the knit sweaters which we already looked at those earlier and we are so behind we could make so many more of those and then for the clothing we unlocked the knit sweaters and scarves and of course you know the beanies and the socks so this was the one that had the um the summer i mean i'm sorry the women's sweater with gray scarf and with a purple scarf etc etc and then it has it for the guys as well so we haven't got that big major one that i'm waiting to get and then as far as the objects go they are all still the same we haven't got anything else but i'm hoping we're like right at the end of level nine so i'm just going to fast forward a little bit and get those so i kind of want to get in cast and go check out the things that i just added and then uh this is a man so we don't have a man in the household so and then this one we already did so i'll probably just give that to somebody actually you know what we'll probably just donate it so we can see what that looks like um since we already did all that so we just maxed the skill yay so we have completely maxed these skills let's see if there's anything new that comes up uh, no, so sweaters, let me see. I'm looking for that major, major one from the trailer that had like all sorts of crazy stuff going on with it. So it must be under here. Let's see real quick. Okay, I don't see, unless it's a poor quality something. It might be supposed to be a poor quality something. So we got to level 10, but everything I see is stuff that we unlocked. I don't see like a level 10 thing that we've unlocked. Uh, let's see the onesies real quick yeah see no these are all level eight all right let's check out the toddler stuff yeah these are level eight too so what was the level 10 thing that we just got that was so crazy great these are all level one all right i'm just going through them real quick to see if we see anything different level two stuff which is a lot of stuff honestly uh so you do actually get like i was thinking we didn't get that many cast hmm. items but you actually do get a lot of stuff once you get into it because look this is just like rows and rows of course these are all swatches so it's not like uh these are all different objects but it's just the different colors for objects ah we got knit child toys these are level 10 okay so we did get some oh whoa okay let's let's go ahead and craft the bear and then let's go and do the um there's a grim reaper and a grim red a grim blue grim classic let's do that and then uh i guess that's all we got y'all excuse D dylan in the background i swear he is he is hype i apologize for the background noise <laughs> those who've been watching me for years know that my kids are always in the background i can't even i would never tell them to shut up like it's just not in me to do it but anyway uh, so it looks like that's the only thing that we got that's a level 10 so let's speed those up real quick jacques i don't even know who you are but we just gonna decline you because i she ain't been out this room since i started so we're just gonna cheat her need like i've been doing and fast forward a little bit 
uh -huh. and we're going to get into uh cast and go check out those items but i kind of want to see what the toys look like so i will see you guys when she's done all right guys we have got everything done i'm not going to even try to craft every single thing i feel like we'll be here for forever so here is Wait a minute. I guess I can't put it on top of the rug. Yeah, I can't put it on top of the rug. So let's, uh, for some reason, it glitches when you put it on top of the rug. Okay, we could put it here. Can I rotate you around, guys, so I can see what you looks like and what you looks like, Lord? And then we got the little bear here. So these are really cute. So these are considered kids' toys. We got the little Grim Reaper and then the little teddy bear over there y'all that is stinking adorable that is so cute all right and i think these are men's stuff yeah so we did everything else so let's just hop in cast real quick and go check out the um the stuff that i've unlocked that we can kind of check out um and i With i'm going to go on and assume Papa. that the sweater I'm going to show you guys it in a second, but the sweater that you're going to unlock, I'm going to assume it must be a poor quality something. So we unlocked this, but we only did one color of it. As far as the tops go, let's go and see. We got a bunch of sweaters that we have gotten unlocked. Uh, we got the black version. Oh my goodness, wait a minute. Let's put on some pants really quickly. Y'all, I love, okay, let's put on, dang it, give me some pants, dang it. Oh my goodness, game, pants. Oh, I don't like these pants. Anyway, I love this sweater. <gasps> Y'all, because when you see it behind here, it's like all lost. So this is the sweater I'm talking about. Requires the sacred knitting knowledge reward trait to craft. The sacred knitting knowledge reward. Okay, um, but anyway, here's this one. I absolutely love this, y'all. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, and I did it in pink as well. Um, that is adorable. I love it. I absolutely love it. All right. Uh, we didn't unlock this one, but it's kind of crazy. How, did this one come up and I just didn't see the option to do it? Because it says requires skill level nine in order to do it. So I must have just missed it. All right. Let's go to the hats really quick. I did a bunch of the hats, y'all. As a matter of fact, I wouldn't be surprised if I did all the hats because when we were trying to level up, I did. Oh, we did all but one. <laughs> So we got the pink, the blue, the green, the two-tone, what is this, like yellow and green, a black and white panda one, got the tiger one, we got the legendary snow tiger one, and then we, oh my gosh, then we got the poor quality one. Oh, that is insane. Look how horrible that looks. I love it though. I love it. I absolutely love it. Okay, and then this one we didn't do, so I'm not sure which one that one is, but this one look at this i think it was this one and it came out poor i'm assuming i don't even <laughs> y'all that is crazy all right and you don't tell them what the poor one of this one looks like but i want i want to see what this is but i want to see this um did we get any more socks i think we did let's double check really quick so oh. i think we did uh yeah we did and we unlocked this one and then this one and then of course the mix match ones and then the only ones we did of these were these two so all right cool so we got all of those yes i want to cancel um so the only thing i didn't see which was the level nine was the jacket with the scarf so i must have overlooked it or maybe i thought it was a men's item and it ended up not being so let me see real quick knit clothing sweaters with scarves uh so i did those black men's gray I bet you that's what it is. Oh, wait, no, it's not coming up. White men, white men's. Okay, well, let's do this then. I'll just go on and add it to the wardrobe and then we'll go back and cast. And then let me add this one to the wardrobe too. And we'll go back and cast. And what I'll do is I'll just toggle masculine off. I mean, feminine off and we'll just Holy do whoever <laughs> and see what I could get from it. Cause that's it's coming up like an option, but I don't see it. Unless I completely overlooked it, which is totally possible. Um, all right, so then it's here now. Hmm, that's interesting. All right, and these are the two that I did do. So I don't know if these are a men's clothing or... Okay, and then this one I did too. But you know what's funny? The fact that this is a man's... Um, I bet you could totally do it for the ladies. I don't see why not. I actually like it for both. Uh, this one right here, though, that's by far my favorite. I'd have to say that's by far my favorite item. I really want to pair it with a really cute bottom, but like this one, oh my goodness. And then put it with those shoes or better yet, if you had the opportunity, hold on, let's see real quick. Cause it might not even work out. Oh y'all. Oh my gosh. We got a whole outfit. 
with skinny Helena Swan. Helena, Helena, Helena. I don't know if it's Helena, Helena, whatever. I just, <laughs> I randomized names and I was like, this looks like her name. Does this not? But y'all, I'm digging it. Wow, okay. This, this pack has completely validated itself for me. I have to give it props. I am pleasantly surprised at, um, I'm gonna go on and keep this on her. I'm pleasantly surprised at the, um, at the amount of stuff you got. And it didn't take us long to level up. Of course, I fast forwarded a bunch. She didn't eat, sleep, drink, pee, do anything, but just knit and work on stuff. But the amount of stuff you get just for, I mean, I would count it, but at least for clothing, one, two, three, four, at least six different clothing items. And for objects, at least six different object items. And then when you go into those object items, it's a bunch of variations of items. I feel like it's quite a bit of stuff in the game um in the gameplay aspect of it again why is this considered a stuff pack and not a game pack they probably said it and i'm recording a bunch of these episodes right now so by the time you guys respond in the comments and tell me what it is i'm probably not going to even <laughs> i'm going to be so far from it at that point i'm probably not going to even know but um but i have to say i'm pleasantly surprised about that i would love to see how this looks on a baby and do that. I would absolutely love to see how this would look on a toddler, but we don't have a toddler in the household. Um, not unless I just go steal somebody's toddler real quick, like, which is a possibility, maybe not. But, you know, it'll, I'll leave a little bit to the imaginations for if you guys who are going to get the stuff pack and you kind of want to see what it looks like once you get it all. Um, I didn't even get a chance to try out these rugs and stuff. So we did these rugs, uh, part of the leveling up situation we got those and then of course you know i have got the two poofs and then we could actually donate this since we got that and then i did another mailbox which is really cute um so yeah i i i like this a lot you can't put stuff on the rug i'm not sure why i couldn't put the what you call it's on the rug but can i donate this or no like she's she's confused about the donation oh oh Oh, sorry. Sorry about that, lady. Okay, you couldn't get past that. Okay, you know what? Now can you get past? Actually, you know what? Put all of this in her inventory because I really just stuck it out to show you guys. We don't need it. I'll probably just end up... Well, I probably won't play with her ever again in life, but if I was to play with her again, I probably would just uh, either donate or sell that stuff. But I really want this out. I don't know why she felt like she couldn't go past that. But uh, So we're donating it right now. I'm assuming that she'll get like a nice little um, moodlet from it from the donation aspect of it. All right, do we get anything? Aw, knittable contribution to, con wait, hold on, hold on. Knittable, Brittany, what are you doing over here? Knittable uh, contribution to the betterment of the society. Knitting for a good cause feels great. It may feel small, but donating knits can have a great impact on a stranger's happiness. That is so cute. And we could probably donate some of these toys and stuff too if we wanted to. But that is pretty much it, y'all, for the gameplay of this pack. Hopefully I gave you guys a nice overview of everything. It's quite a bit of stuff. I have to admit, it's quite a bit of stuff, um, which maybe is the reason why there wasn't so many in Cass and Bill Bai, uh, which would totally make sense because it's all in the actual gameplay of the um, of the pack. So Hopefully you guys enjoy. Let me know what you think in the comment box down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up the video. Let me know what you think. If I missed anything, also let me know what you think about that. Um, I'm assuming once we were to finish this uh, Lady of Knots, yeah, this will get us that sweater. So if I was to complete all of this, this would get us that sweater. So for some reason, knit while listening to music, even though we had music on the background, is so much so that the thing ended up breaking while I was playing. Um, we never got credit for that. So, um, which is crazy because we probably would have gotten the 10 excellent. Now, gift three nittables. We would, yeah, we would have got everything. We didn't get, I don't know if we got five legendaries, but we would at least got majority of the stuff. And then I could have, oh, teach another sim to knit. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, yeah, I'll leave some of it up to you guys to kind of discover. And let, like I said, let me know what you think in the comment box down below. And I will let you guys go. I think I think we're good here. Um, I will put the she... Well, I guess if you guys want the she shed, let me know. I'll put it in the, in the um, gallery. I'll probably put it as a room. So that way um, you could just get the room. Because this lot is not mine. Um, 
but it's funny because it looks like it goes together, right? It does. It looks like it goes together. That's crazy. Uh, but I probably will. If you guys want me to put it in the gallery, let me know. It's uh, it's kind of simple. It's not anything super major about it, but I do actually really like it. Uh, her little she shit. But anyway, <laughs> I will see you guys in the next episode, next video. I'm about to say next episode. You won't see her ever again in life. I gotta go, y'all. I'm Looney Tooney, like I said. But I really appreciate you guys sticking through with me and watching this video. And I'll see you guys next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.